Thousands of tourists have been taking advantage of the last hours of sunlight to make their way home on this Labor Day. Live pictures right now from the Turnpike in Bitterford. Traffic was heaviest midday, but as you can see right now, again, in these live pictures, really no issues on the Turnpike at this hour. And of course, with summer season winding down, businesses and local tourism experts are taking a moment now to look back on a season they are calling a success, even with that very soggy start. Here's New Center Maine's Chloe Tebow. It's a sound that echoes through towns and cities across Maine every summer. Millions of tourists in the span of a few months making their way to some of our most popular destinations. We've seen about a 12% increase in visitor traffic to our visitor centers, which is positive. Tony Cameron is CEO of the Maine Tourism Association. He says the summer of 2023 is shaping up to be a successful one, despite some roadblocks. I think it's going to be a decent year. I think that despite the rain, businesses have been able to do well because demand for travel is still there. Demand that usually brings in a good chunk of change. Last year in 2022, visitors spent $8.6 billion. There are livelihoods dependent on that money. The main office of tourism says every 102 visitors who come here support a new job. I think we're back. I think Old Orchard is back. Fred Kennedy isn't new to his job. He and his wife have owned the Alouette Beach Resort in Old Orchard Beach for more than 20 years. Summer is everything. That's our business. So that's our bread and butter, particularly the end of June to uh, mid-September. Nearly three months that bring in more than three times the amount of money as the rest of the year. We take in 80% of our revenue in the summertime. We're pretty much on par so far for what we did last year. Allison Rickard at Dock Square Clothiers in Kenny Bunkport says they're on track to have another decent post-pandemic summer. We've just had the cruise ships pick up this month, especially is like cruise ship season. So. A lot of different people from different places. People who are making an impact on Mainers' lives with every trip. Chloe Tebow, New Center, Maine.